guys, Wisteria here, and today, as you can see, I am once again reconvening with my playing of the game Star Stable. Oh man, someone's uh, coming right at- oh, okay, cool, I'll just gallop through us, you know, that's- that's fine, I mean, I don't need to be respected or anything. Oh, we got a friendship invitation. Heck yeah, we are popular kids now. Anyways, guys, today I'm going to be doing a sequel to my original Star Stable gameplay, which I believe is called First Time Playing Star Stable Noob Style. But before we get into this disaster of a video, I would like to share with all of you this snazzical app called Star Stable Online Amino. Basically, I'm partnering with Star Stable Amino to get a bunch of my viewers to come on and join this app because it's essentially its own social network dedicated to fans of Star Stable Online. This is an awesome app because it will help you get connected with all sorts of lovers of Star Stable through the featured posts on the front page, the public chat rooms, and more. And it's a very safe, kid-friendly community, so you never have to worry about online drama of any sort. So let me just show you guys real quick one of my favorite posts from the featured tab. It's actually a Star Stable's related edit from a movie called Spirit, and this is a beautiful, beautiful edit of the two main characters in the movie. So I thought this was an absolutely amazing post, so I went ahead and uh, gave it a little like. So basically, you can scroll through, find your favorite posts and leave likes and comments on them. You can also click this little pen in the corner to create posts of your own. And then you can click on your profile in the top left corner, click on your little icon, and then you will see your own profile where all your posts will show up. So at the top of the description of this video, I have left a link that you can click to download this app to your phone. This app is available for devices of all sorts, including iPhones, Androids, and tablets. So be sure to follow that link, download this app, and then search up my profile with Stereo Moon, scroll down, and check out my most recent post, which is basically a question asking what players love the most about Star Stable. As you can see, some people have already answered my question, but I would like to get a ton of likes and answers on this. So everyone go ahead and download this app for me if you haven't already, especially if you are a Star Stables fan, because I would really, really appreciate some more activity on my first and most beloved post. Now it is time for me to once again navigate the magical realm of Jorvik or Jorvik. I am not entirely sure how it's pronounced, to be honest. All I know is that's the name of this magical little world and that I'm still literally the worst at riding my horse like what the heck? What the heck are these things anyway? Got a bunch of ships and cargo. Ooh, that guy looks angry. We gotta gotta stop it up a little bit. Need to check this dude out. Don't quit backing me up. <laughs> well, I guess we'll never uh, we'll never see his face, but that's that's cool. I didn't even want to. All right, so let's go head onto this cargo ship. How do I get this thing to jump? Like, what the heck, man? I just want to jump. <sighs> looks like we gotta do it the old-fashioned way. Come on. No, 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 no. Whoa. All right. Just gonna wanna walk on over. Walk on over to that spooky-looking ship. There we go. Just gonna make our descent slowly, you know? Slow and steady wins the race. I don't want to be crashing into any buildings or anything. All right, there we go. We are now on a cargo ship. Oh man, that was a head-on collision. My poor horse. I'm surprised my horse hasn't disowned me by now. Wait, can we jump off? I bet we can. Oh, come on. Don't be such a wimp. Come on, Bluestone. I thought you were more man than that. We can jump it. We can jump right into that watch. JK, we can't. Um, uh, my horse is literally like, no, please. Uh oh, we're having some troubles here. Houston, we have a problem. I believe I have blockaded myself. This is not good. How do I get on okay there we go all right guess we're, we're making it work all right forward uh-oh we're in the like wrong direction now all right there we go glad to know i am not completely terrible at this just hit that guy. Man, I am good at this. Why is this sparkling? Ooh, I hear music. Let's walk towards it. Find item. Picnic basket. What? All right, that's lovely. So we're gonna have to run all around this place looking for a picnic basket. This is severely confusing me. Maybe it's in here. I see some more sparkly stuff. Find item. Barbecue set. Oh, man. It wants me to find all kinds of stuff. All right, what about this one? More picnic baskets. Oh, man. I don't know how I'm gonna do this. It says I have unread mail, but I don't know how to read my mail. So here's the plan so far. Gonna try to find some, some barbecue and stuff. A picnic basket basket and a mailbox moreland i hope we're going towards town oh we just straight up dove off that oh my gosh are you serious did we just get stuck in a bush oh my gosh i am about to give up on this oh there we go all right so i don't think there are any mailboxes in here oh no my horse is sad we got another thing on our to-do list guys maybe we need to go back to the stable you see i think i'm supposed to go back to my stable for this but awkwardly enough i kind of forgot where it is so you know this is just gonna be trial and error all right i think this is it oh yeah this is where my boy just is. Now let's go to our backpack. Let's drag a brush on this kid. Oh, there we go. Man, I'm feeling proud of myself right now. All right, let's give it some hay. Oh yeah. Eat that hay, Bluestone. Eat it up. You're about to get real healthy here. Water in our horse. Uh-oh, I have no hay left. That's cool. That's really 
cool. Um, yeah. Love it when there's no food left. How do we get more food? What a lovely view right there. What is up, my man? My horse is still sad. Why is my horse sad? Spoiled brat. Gonna have to give it more stuff. How do I make this horse happy? Let's go and ask Justin. Gonna shimmy on over. Oh, I see. He's chatting up Quint. Oh, okay. She just, like, sees the incoming threat and just disappears. Come on, Justy. Give me some advice. Back off, Quinn. That's right. Know your natural place. Wow, Justin. You are useless. Officially useless. It's time to just back away from here. Backing away from all our problems. Uh-oh. So, apparently, I was supposed to take care of this horse every day. You know, that's just too high maintenance, all right? I think it's time to trade in for a different horse, you know? I want something that's, like, more low maintenance. I should be getting pretty close. Is that Spirit? Is Spirit the horse in this game? Dude, that's sick. Oh my god. But yeah, like, I'm thinking that this horse should only need food and water, like, once every week. At most. All right, let's figure out how to get some food. Oh, what? Apparently there's a health bar. Oh man, that's, that is not a good sign. Um, I've been bumming into quite a bit of things. I am surprised my horse isn't dead by now, actually. But uh, yeah, I guess, guess that's a good sign. All right, let's go back to the city. Returning the Moorland Stables riding shoe. What the heck? Uh, oh, what? I don't want to start a race. Uh, this is just too much effort for me. Gotta work our way up to top speed. It's gonna be kind of hard because my horse is a very, very sad animal right now. I haven't fed it for like a month. <laughs> gonna have to just hope that all goes well during this race. Oh man, I just went off the track. Going great, guys. It's going great. I am literally the best at races. Watch out, kids. Watch out. Yeah, that's right. I'm gonna run you over because you didn't watch out. But yeah, literally, we are going so slow right now. Like, my horse has literally like starved for the past month. So, I mean, I kind of understand, but at the same time, it's a little disappointing. You lost? What? How the heck did I lose? This is unacceptable. We're going again. I'm literally going as fast as physically possible. Assuming I don't run into anything, I should definitely win this race. Oh man, we're coming in for a tight turn. Oh, bam! Aced it. Come on, hurry up. I know you're suffering crippling depression right now, but I believe in you, Blue Stone. Come on, come on, come on, come on. <gasps> Personal best. Congratulations. You beat your own best score. Oh yeah, that's right. Race finished. You completed it. Good job. Oh, Yes! Did we get any money? No, no, we didn't. We actually got nothing. I love it when that happens. All right, so these boots cost 7,850 coins and I have 130. Beautiful. This place is a little expensive for me personally. I'm gonna be giving this a bad review on Google. Sorry, but need to work. Work on your affordability. Didn't know that this was some like high-end luxury horse place. Oh, cool. I can get some food. Are you kidding me? This food costs 50 coins, man. 50 coins. That's more than than a third of my entire income for one piece of hay. This horse is gonna die. This horse is going to straight up die. I can't even literally afford to feed it. Well, guess we gotta have no other choice. The other places have some better prices. Oh, that's cool. The camera's just not even gonna follow me. I'm just- I legitimately just ran away from myself. Um, I don't know what's happening here, but okay then. Wow, I'm just- I'm just running off into the distance. Man, don't you just love it when that happens? You know, I don't even know how to react to this. I think I broke it. I I think I broke Star Stable. You know what, guys? Um, was fun while it lasted. Alrighty, guys. So, uh, we apparently left off with me literally having broken Star Stables, which is just lovely. I feel like this video has been pretty much a train wreck, which I anticipated, but I didn't anticipate it being this bad. I literally broke the game and, uh, have been wandering around extremely confused for 90% of the video, and I almost just drowned my horse in addition to that. So I feel like at this point, I'd like to conclude it by completing a bit of a quest because I feel like it's kind of ridiculous to have made an entire video and uh, accomplish nothing. So without further ado, let's go ahead and keep our horse from repeatedly crashing into the fence and head on over to the quest booklet. Oh, wait a second. We got another quest from Thomas Moreland. Ride past the blacksmith's stand up towards the hill. There's a power distribution box. Alrighty, let's head on over towards the hills. Hopefully we will find what we're looking for there. We are now in Moreland. Very relaxing location. Is there a blacksmith around here? Aha. This looks pretty blacksmith-ish to me. Let's give a good old chat to this fellow up here. Great, this guy wants me to find stuff for him. I don't even know how the heck I do this, but uh, I'll try our best. First of all, we gotta look for that sign. All right, so now it's telling me to go towards the fuzzy orange area. So I'm gonna try that. Still do not see a sign. Oh, wait a second. Oh, well, there we go. Now I feel a little bit dumb. I'm pretty sure I wrote right past it. That's cool. Now let's see if we can find this dude's hammers and stuff. Oh man, get two quests done in one day. It's been mighty productive. Let's just dive bomb off this cliff real quick. All right, now we're in the thick of things. Let's look for some glowing orange stuff. Oh, I see one. Oh yes. Oh ho ho yes. That, my friends, is a completed quest. Oh, oops. Only one out of three items. It's fine. Get the rest. It's no biggie. Just gotta get unstuck from this wheel first. Aha. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. That 
was a bad idea. Aha! I think you can hide from me. Why can I not click it? There we go. Conrad's pliers. Beautiful, beautiful stuff. Now if we just go a little bit this way. So we can tell from the map because I'm actually looking at that for once. Oh yes. Full speed ahead. Okay, okay, okay. Stop, stop. stop. Tools of the tree. Conditions fulfilled. <laughs> Alrighty. Let's report back. I need my money. Why can't horses hop through fences like humans? Just a random thought right there. Alrighty, yes. Give me my money, Thomas. Thank goodness. I think I've just discovered how useful the map actually is. I kind of disregarded it the whole time and now I'm realizing, wow, it solved a lot of problems. All right, here we have it. Moreland Forge. Hey up, my man. I need to feed this horse for another day. Ha, you are an angel, Mia. That's right. You know who to hit up next time you need assistance. I'm an angel. Wow, that is right. Thank you for that, my friend. Let's give our inventory a quick look. Wow, would you look at that? Back up to a whopping 130 coins. We can now feed our horse for an additional two days. Man, how lovely is that? You hear that, Bluestone? Two more days until you're starving. I'm such a good owner. <laughs> Anyways, guys, I think that's about all for today's Star Stable disaster. I apologize in advance to all the pros who are watching and face palming in the process, but I hope that you can appreciate the fact that I'm slowly learning. I mean, I'm trying. But anyways, I think that that's just about going to wrap it up for this little Star Stable Online gameplay. Again, if you would like to see more Star Stable gameplays in the future, please let me know in the comments below. And as always, thank you all so much for watching. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!